Oh, what's up, guys? Nick here with a brand new episode of Marvin. <laughs> a brand new unboxing video. I haven't said that I'm going to record anything lately. Uh, I hope y'all watched Mega Man. Yeah, I just put it up like this morning because I knew it was going to take about how long? Take about an hour and a half to upload. So uh, I got a few more things to unbox. Got three games to unbox. Let's see. We got Halo Master Chief Collection. Madden 15 and Sunset Overdrive. How did I get all these? Uh, text time. We'll, we'll just say that. Um, got myself an Xbox One again. Uh, just all the way at the bottom right there. It's it's underneath the green light down there. And if you need any more proof, I'll just grab the box of this Assassin Creed bundle. So, not showing y'all that. And this came free with it. So, I got the two Assassin's Creed games and Madden 15 from Target, of all places. I'm like, huh, if that deal is actually in store, I'll do that. And it was. So, all right. Let's start off with the least exciting, Madden 15. I don't remember if I'd done a Madden 15. There was another game, but I've already done an unboxing video for it, so there's no really no point. Uh, Dead Rising 3. No point of doing an unboxing video for a game I've already unboxed. And I, I've already taken the wrapping and stuff off of it, mainly because I bought it used for like 22 bucks. So, yeah. And in the background, I'm actually downloading uh, Plants vs. Zombies Garden Warfare. It was only 10 bucks. I have a little bit of money left. From my payday, not from taxes or anything like that. I'm not worried about that more. So, we have. I don't know his name. Someone comment who it is. Sherman, I believe, is his last name. I think. For Seahawks. Huh. Speaking of who's going to Super Bowl, Seahawks. I hope they win. I don't... Ah, uh, it's Madden season. Transform into a rival's worst nightmare with a new breed of defense. Built to challenge the best offense in the NFL. A new arsenal of pass rush moves. Improved coverage logic and immersive. New camera angles make the defense exciting and fun to play. Call plays with confidence thanks to a new all an all new crowdsourced recommended built engine built for millions of online games. Add a add in NFL films inspired presentations and it's not just football, it's Madden season. Oh, that was a lot. Deliver it on D. An all new tackling system puts defense in control. All new broadcasting presentation, dynamic pregame and halftime shows, broadcast graphics, and all new camera angles deliver the sights and sounds of Sunday. On one Xbox, one four players, Xbox Live two players. What sense is that? What? What? How you got four player on one Xbox but not on the other? And I'm not lying. It shows Xbox and Xbox Live beside of it. And co-op two player, meaning two on a team. So, go ahead. Can't share that. That's money off of NFL sh stuff. And here's the box, or the disc. Now, I've always, always, always been irritated. It's always on this side. Always been on this side, and you open it up, it's on this side. Alright, let's see next. Let's go in our box Master Chief Collection. In all actuality, I'm supposed to be formatting the Xbox, but I haven't done it just yet. Main reason, I want to bend down. I'm going to down do it after this recording. So right now, I'm supposed to be recording uh, Mario, but I got home late, so y'all can wait on that. And that's not coming out until Monday anyway. I'm either recording tonight or uh, tomorrow night or Sunday. I'm off Sunday, so. Even hit the classic thing that I. Nope. Yeah. I like skimmed. Now, here's the thing that gets me about this. I remember hearing something about you get an ODST for free. I'm thinking that's just for people who had it at the time who got to download it. Unless it's still free. I don't know. Uh, okay. Alrighty. On the front. You got Master Chief, or his helmet at least. 
You have the three renditions, which are very hard to see. There's Halo 1, 2, 3, 4. Yeah, it is really hard to see them. Now, I will say 2 and 3 look the most alike, and the other one's using like an old tiny one. <sighs> Includes four full games, a remastered Halo 2 Anniversary, Halo Combat Evolved Anniversary, Halo 3, and Halo 4. Now, I already own Halo 4, but I'll gladly play this one. I'll gladly, gladly play this version of it also. I'll probably play this more than the other, obviously, because next gen, but I don't think it really matters. I mean, it's been, what, a year, year and a half since the last one, something like that? I don't know. Uh, 45 campaign missions. Access to Halo 5 Guardian multiplayer beta, which I think is over by now. Over 100 multiplayer maps. Good. Uh, all together. I'm like, whoa, what? Halo Knight... I should be doing this. Halo Nightfall, an all-new act live-action digital series from ex executive producer Ridley Scott. One to four players on one console, which is a good thing. Co-op two to four, online two to six, and co-op two to four. Meaning, if you put on the same console, it's two to four players. And online is two to four in co-op mode, and two to sixteen on the other. I don't know what impulse triggers are, so don't call me on that. Uh, is there anything else? Oh, rated in for blood, gore, language, and violence. It doesn't really cuss that much. I played this game. I played all of them. I own Halo uh, 2 and 4. I own 2 for the original Xbox. That was a mine, really. What is this? Entertainment download and store. You no. Know? <laughs> Look at this. Is that for it? I don't know. It says something about downloading. Oh, the beta. Two days of Xbox Gold! Yeah, I got an advertisement for the next unboxing. Anyway, there's a disc. Kind of plain. Just, just a black disc with a little bit of triangles or squares on it or something. And Halo Master Chief Edition. There's Halo Master Chief. Um. I'll probably use this gold live sometime soon, and this other one is actually for the series itself. Alright, now for the headliner, Sunset Overdrive. I've been wanting to play this game, this was one of the main reasons why I wanted to get an Xbox One again, next to Halo and a possible Gears of War game in the future, and all the new IPs they could be making and all this stuff, you know. But this is one of the main ones, because I saw it and I'm like, wow. And another one, uh, Project Spark, which I did see at the stores. I'm like, wait, that game came out? I'm thinking, I'm, I'm spending a little bit much. I need to get that. But, so I have to wait. And it says, only on Xbox One. And I always get this other stuff off in this way because it's much easier this way. I used to struggle real, real bad. Alrighty. Sunset Overdrive. You have the main dude on the front, which I think, which I've heard you can customize to whatever, whatever you want. There's a couple people on here, and some zombies and some ninja chick. I never did show the back of Halo, did I? No. That's the back. I'm, I'm, wait, because I'm going on eight minutes here. Oh, and to prove I also have an Xbox One controller. I like their controller for some reason. I really like it. Okay. Anyway. Rules are meant to be exploded. Okay. A contaminated energy drink has transformed most of the Sunset City into toxic mutants. For many, it's the apocalypse, but years of playing video games have prepared you t to not just survive, but to thrive. Welcome to Sunset Overdrive, a high-voltage open-world shooter filled with unconventional weapons, crazed mutants, and massive carnage. An open world with no rules. Leap off buildings, grind rails, and zip down power lines to destroy your foes from every angle. Kind of sounds like Infamous to me, but hey, I like Infamous, and this is a it's a third-person shooter where it's free roaming. Is this a two-player? Okay, lethal weapons. Collect and upgrade an arsenal of unconventional weapons. They use items like dynamite, fireworks, harpoons, and acid to destroy your enemies. Mayhem with friends. 
Join forces in eight player cooperative experience Chaos Squad. Tackle a variety of objectives throughout the city, survive epic battles against countless enemies, and earn awesome in game rewards. Rated M for blood, go blood and gore, drug references, sexual themes, strong, la strong language, and violence. The violence is given. Nothing special, okay. I've been taking out special stuff this entire time. You know what? I'm just going to put this in here. Don't make a damn difference. Yeah, that wasn't in there. You know, who's going to advertise, put the advertisement of this in the game that's that? Anyway, there's the disc. Turn that eye. Looks like the blood of the monsters or something. I don't know. But, that's in that one. How far am I? My, shoot. 40% already. And I'm going to play that with Bud. He told me, you know, it's on here for 10 bucks. Why don't you just go ahead and do it? Alright, but uh, thank you all for watching, hope you enjoyed this, I'm going to go set up my Xbox One and eventually play it, I don't know when yet, but I'll play it, you know, I have all the exclusives now, that's the one thing, so now, if I ever decide to do my reviews again, which probably won't happen, I have to, I have to get a game that is so awesome or amazing or sucks so bad that I need to go back to recording reviews, I mean just sitting here talking. You know, I would love to do that, but I don't want to because it's just sitting here talking. I'd rather, you know, play a game while I'm at. That's why I do my Let's Plays. But, hope y'all enjoyed this. If y'all haven't watched Mega Man, go watch it. It's an hour and 11 minutes or something like that. Uh, Bud's also in it. So, he and I enjoy watching me play this. And the final boss is there. An awesome final boss. You know, I didn't have a huge problem with him at all. You know, it was like, okay... Usually with the final boss, you fight it first, see what kind of strategy it is. Most of the time you die first, or, uh, then you figure out a strategy, and you have to utilize the strategy, and you just how to use the chips and stuff. So, anyway, before I rant on about that, thank you all for watching. Hope you enjoyed this. I will catch you on the next either unboxing video or, well, probably not unboxing video, but I'll catch you on Mario, which will be the finale. I am going to rush through the rest of that to finish the game. Just like Mega Man, it was long as hell. And if I reach like an hour, I'll stop. But see y'all later.